we did not know this was going to turn into a, a toy hunt vlog. In guys. any way. Yeah, no. Shopping spree. Uh, pro probably one of the greatest items that I own in my collection. Uh, same. Just, uh, this is, yeah, this is it for Buffalo. me, yeah. Yeah, literally all walked out with graded action figures uh, and we showed up to do business for All Elite Wrestling. What's up, everybody? It's All Elite Goethe Page here for another Sunday, a very special toy hunt video. It's a little, this one's gonna be a little bit different. Even though we're not going to a toy store, we are actually going to a warehouse where Dave and Adams host a live show where myself, Evil Uno, Smart Mark Sterling, make an appearance for All Elite Wrestling, opening some AEW cards from Upper Deck, which was very fun. They provided the footage to me. It'll be chopped up in a beautiful way. We also got a VIP tour of the warehouse and they let us buy stuff. That's right. Not only do I end up with multiple graded comics, which we will be discussing soon. I also end up with a graded action figure. Guys, I grabbed some pretty holy grail stuff with Evil Uno and Smart Mark Sterling in Buffalo, New York. So I'm gonna take you guys there right now, but I wanna remind everyone that every Sunday is brought to you by Whatnot. Do not forget to download the app. Link is in the description. You get $10 off your first auction on me. And like, subscribe, and comment. Go follow my pals and enjoy this very special video. It is very, 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 very awesome. Yeah, yeah, if you want, I'll at least uh, help, we'll help break the seal on that. This is crazy. Believe it or not, too, like this, like what, probably eight months ago, this was just a, this was a room full of comics in that. Yep. Really? Wow. Yeah. You guys didn't stream strong. back This then? was just more storage. Did you stream back then as well? No. Not even. No, Wait, no. so this is a new show? Yeah, we launched in June. We today launched was, in June. Today was episode 39. 39. 39, wow. okay. Where is this available if you want to watch our episode? Yeah, twitch.tv slash DA Card World, all one word. Cool. YouTube too? Yeah, YouTube yeah. as well. YouTube slash DA Card World. All right, so cool. kind of kept it straight across the board so it's easy to find. Mark, tell them why they should watch us open cards. Well, hopefully we'll get some hits. Uh, it's oh, going to be really exciting. And yeah, uh, uh, yeah I don't know. Are we going to grip them and rip them? We're going to rip them. <laughs> <laughs> Let's do it. We got the stars of AEW in the house, Smart Mark Sterling, All Ego, Ethan Page, and of course, the Dark Order's Evil Uno. Number one, throwing up the deuces. Also, we've covered this a lot on the Major Wrestling Figure Podcast. Oh, it's just so weird because I don't cover these on my weekly toy vlog. I know every Sunday at one o'clock on my YouTube channel, but... I can't wait to look at them today. <laughs> Graded action figure today. Mm -hmm. So I, I might be too. Yeah. Oh no, I'm bullying both of you guys into buying stuff that you. Oh really? Right. Okay. Yeah. Right. Especially if I'm filming. Yeah. That's true. We gotta put it on a show, boys. That's true. <laughs> graded the action figures. Graded movie scripts. Yeah. This is VHSs. that are still wrapped. The video games are boy. Is all this stuff available on your guys' website? Yeah, dacarworld.com. Most uh, most things are available right uh, right there. Yeah, What's yeah. that website again? Dacarworld.com. I'll be shot. Yeah, people, watch, people watching this know that. But now I know it. I'm for sure shopping on your guys' website. I didn't like the stuff you guys had available. We didn't even know we were was an option. Yeah. And like we're like I would say pretty deep in the collecting world. Mm -hmm. Like to, to see stuff that was blowing, that was blowing our mind, yeah. blowing our mind. So I think that's huge that we were able to do that today. We were able to unearth something oh, for yeah. them, something oh, new. Oh, you really guys have pretty much seen it all. We thought we were here to real. unpack cards. I yeah. didn't realize we'd be seeing graded stuff, and I'm literally going to be buying things. Yeah. <laughs> Crazy. 
We got customers. Love that. All right. Uh, what do you guys want to do first? You want to do AEW? Yeah. Do we yeah, want to plug yeah, that some more? We're, we're 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 first. That. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Because I've seen Luchasaurus's autograph when yeah. he gets lazy. Yeah. It's just an L. Oh, yeah. This yeah. Is, so you got some swiggles on there. Wow. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's yeah. that's yeah. the first hour of signing. That's oh, cool. Cool. That's a, hey, by the way, too, that's one of five. Oh, oh, five. Oh, oh, oh. Super low print. Yeah, only five of them out there. Super short number. So that's it. Wow. We, so, we got, so we got five of the good ones out there. Oh, now we're not going to get And that. then the rest yeah. might be the L's. Yeah. 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 Okay. Um, yeah, we. That's actually we one of our. Right? Yeah. What, yeah. What you Where say? do we go from? So what I was gonna say was, uh, we've all signed something in regards to these cards. Mm -hmm. and it's because it's been taking so long for everything to come out. I don't know the process of how cards are made, but eventually there will be Ethan Page signed uh, cards available. Yeah. I this is documented in my vlog. Have signed a couple cards, like one specific way. So there will be a one of one. Ethan Page signed AEW card, like there'll be one with a star, I think I signed one as Julian, uh, so this, this yeah. is, there will be like a couple one of ones available. Scheming, I'm manifesting a movie, manuscript in a million, I thought that you knew me, focusing on the Fetty, the longevity, lifestyle, build a future me, what I'm usually doing right now, smoking with my shot and we plotting another hundred grand. Okay, so Dante actually gave me a genius idea, thank you Dante. Anyone that's watching the vlog that collects trading cards that ends up with some of my Ethan Page signature cards. One is gonna be exclusively different than the rest and it's going to be this one right here. There's a star on it. There will only be one with a star in the corner. If you get that card and you find me, I will give you free merchandise from playedbyjulian.com. Also, it's one of a kind, so probably worth something. Currency from Europe, my energy from the motherland. Which is funny you say that because that's happening, that's starting to happen a lot more in the sports world too. Yeah. Guys are signing stuff and they're specifically saying like, I, I remember there was one basketball player who literally wrote, uh, watch, or you know, keep an eye out for this card for me. Or like, watch out for this card for me. Yeah. Keep it safe. So yeah. you know, a lot of guys are doing that. So I think that's a huge note for collectors right there. Yeah, especially you now. Ripping cards. You collect cards. Look out for these cards. Yeah. yeah. I would pull one of mine. Yeah. Yeah. Let's. Yeah. Let's, I did we'll all mine regular. Yeah. Are you not in this line? You're not in this one, Ethan. No. No. You'll no, be in the next one, right? I think Spectrum, I believe, is coming out sooner rather than later. I hope I'm in that one too. You know, this set. This is AW uh, Series One, right? Mm -hmm. So technically, a lot of rookie cards in here. You know, MJF, his technical rookie card. Do you count some of the indie cards that were? created for him oh that's a great question yeah because so, i got some beef with these indie cards because the, no one ever asks the talent permission it's kind of yes. just like they're just Same. trying to make pennies as quickly as possible so then now they have all these cards in the world with my likeness on it that i never agreed to that i nicely signed for fans because i'm a gentleman but <laughs> i didn't i didn't i didn't have any say but now they have these cards that are in the world are these my rookie cards well it depends on the collector i think really so some people, like there's, I know Limitless Wrestling and MJF that I think is the first, there's GCW MJF. Yep. But it depends because, you know, some people are like, no, it's got to be one of the main card sets. Which I feel like that's what you see if you go to eBay and, you know, everybody's obsessed with eBay looking at comps and, you know, checking out prices of different cards. Uh, I've seen things with, with, you know, sports figures that these, before they were in the, in the league or just oh, kind of yeah, some yeah. of these custom cards do not go for as much money as say, you know, an a like a, an upper deck rookie. So I would say this is this is a case where that would be a true rookie in so my here's opinion. My, here, here's my opinion of it. If someone is just gonna customize and make whatever they want, they, you could literally have had a card. The day I was born someone could have made a, 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 a baby. Yeah, card. a baby yeah, card. That's true. my first card. But <laughs> I think if it comes in a pack and you have to rip it and it's like presented as like 
we don't know if you're gonna get this card. Like like a true pack of cards. Yeah. To me, that's the real thing. Or else you could just go look for like a random. There's a million Ethan Page cards out there. Well, that, I had no say. Right. Hi. No. Hi. This is here we are. Oh, okay. Here we are. Dave and Adam's it. card world. Yep. Thank you. And uh, whew, baby. Yeah. We came here to do a little stream ski. Yeah. Got a little tour. Uh huh. Oh baby. Uh, I and mean, now what are we doing? Now we're. I kind of shopping. I don't even know if you can. So this work trip turned into a toy hunt? Yes. Yes. Oh, that's true. Which means it's brought to you by Whatnot. Click the link in the description. Download the app. Save $10 on me. Or, you know what? Use Mark's. Uh, MajorWhatnot.com, babes. Uh, don't, what? don't use his. I hate when he says babes. It's, <laughs> it's so annoying. <laughs> Check this out, though. Look, we're just looking. Hey, look at the shopping cart. Oh, I'm gonna go shopping. Oh, look what I have in here. Oh, just, just you know, just a graded uh, pink Pikmin. Okay, there were so many good ones in here, and you picked this. Resident Evil. This Pokemon Blue. Emerald. Water graded. Woods. Graded. Oh, this was the one I played, Blue. I, yep. Blue. I was a red guy. I was a red guy. I was a red guy, too. Hey, little buddy, wanna ride? Pikachu. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> I'll be right back. Where can you catch all 150 Pokemon? Got ya. On your Game Boy, that's where. Pokemon for Game Boy is here. With both packs, you can catch them all. Blue, this one. Oh, look at this. Come on. Ocarina of Time. Gold Classic box. Game. Gold box. Seven. And then this one's crazy. This is not graded yet. But take a look at this game. Super Mario 3. Uh, the challenge set. This, I've been told, sealed, is what came with the Nintendo, right? What kid got the Nintendo, pulled out the game that came with, and goes, eh, I'm not going to open it. Uh, it what? could be one of us with kids. That's true. <laughs> a, ch a child with a lot of foresight, that's for sure. Or a parent with a lot of foresight. Unbelievable. <laughs> yeah, this is insane. But then also... Oh, here this we go. This is what Julian was going on. Oh, yeah, here we go. Oh, wait a second. What? You're going to bust out, bust my oh, purchase? No, will, just, will you show? Here, no, I'm just mad messing with you. I'm messing. No, you no, no, no. You show. <laughs> you show. On the spot. What, what do we got? So what I'm doing is purchasing this entire box. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 no way. Dude, these are all oh, yeah, great. At least one for me. Great. You going to get one? Yeah, probably. Yeah. I'll, I'll buy the Mr. Freeze if you buy an animated series graded figure as well. Noted. Settled. All right. Who are we gonna talk to? <laughs> but he doesn't here. know how much that. Okay, is. All, all that matters. Please, if you could point it at me for two seconds, uh, uh, Julian, when you edit this, do not reveal the price. Oh no no we don't we don't do prices. Okay good. Oh yeah you're married. Yes. And he wants to stay married. <laughs> 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 all right look at this. Who do they got? Okay who would you be interested in for real? This is uh, rated animated see. series by the way. It's Batman. Two faces on a firing frenzy. Charging into action. It's combat belt Batman. You just got on my bad side, Batman. Tough luck. Great save. Oh, no. Robin swoops down in his parrowing. Fire. A narrow miss. Batman in the invincible hover bat. No contest. Capture Claw. Two faces off to serve double time. The eyes of justice, Batman. We've got the Bruce Wayne. Bane. We've got Bane. Which... I actually would love one that I don't have yet, but I think I have most of these. Uh, that bat power bell Batman in the bat. At the back? Power Vision Batman. There I do go. not have that for sure. The deluxe crime fighter. That's edition. gonna cost me a fortune, isn't it? <laughs> well, I, I don't, honestly, I don't think so. I think any of the deluxe, they're not as rare. What really? Because I don't have to depend on the uh, game. Were you looking for uh, Royal Rumble uh, Super for Super Nintendo? No. You think know. he's gonna get it? I don't you think know. they're gonna? Hey, point it, point in this direction. Look at this way. Yeah, we'll find. We'll they, <laughs> they definitely have it here. Yeah. They definitely have it. We'll here. find it. We haven't even gone to the comic books. I know. Oh, you this know. is. I know. I've just talked about this in your vlog. Danhausen is hunting this, by the way. It's here. They this have, is, they this have is, like eight of them graded. This is really? my favorite. Yeah. This, I think, is the best Spider Man, Man figure. I mean, you know, until the Marvel. Why is this yes, head yes. so small? Doesn't matter, dude. This Come is on. the most articulated figure of, of its time for This is unreal. Yeah, yeah. Figures have that normal, but when you got this as a kid, you're like, "What? You yeah. can do a Hercarana?" <laughs> yeah. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna go inquire about how much I'm about to lose. That leaves you, Mark. Well, I would get this. I gotta find the price, though. Wait, actually, I, I'm not paying them. Yeah. You know, yeah, you a zillion dollars. <laughs> who would sign for the child? John Rosengrant. I don't know who that is. Oh, that must be like John Rosengrant. He created the. 
He did the baby voices. There's got to be some kind of connection. We got Ted DiBiase. Oh, that Yondu sign? That's cool. Who signed the Beast? Robbie Benson. That's so cool. I wanted a graded one, but now I want all of them graded. This I know. Is a terrible start. Whoa, look at this Punisher with the jacket. Oh, I had that. That's cool. Fantastic Four. So, should we look at the graded books? Yeah, I think so. There's a lot of Batman. <laughs> Let's go. Yeah, it's crazy. Single day, so. Dude, I know. There was a, a Spider-Man book over here that blew my mind. The, uh, that yeah. Oh, yeah. Kingpin? Yeah. It's like so good. So foreign? So if it's from a different country? Yeah. Oh, I yeah. Like, oh so okay. I've been buying up a lot of that stuff. Do uh, they mostly just have different language or does the cover art change yeah. at all? No, the cover art changes and that's actually Whoa. One, of the, one of the most interesting things about, because that's different cover art. That's cool. different color scheme. So if you get like Captain America in Russia, they weren't yeah. allowed to put the red, white, and blue on him. So he's different color. Oh, that's so oh. cool. And Moon Knight, uh, the, uh, the Spanish edition for Moon Knight, he is blue and red. No way. He's, yeah, he's blue and red for that. So he's still I'm going to look all still, this up. He's still called Moon I never even thought about this. I know, stuff. same. So actually, I was going to show you guys. I have a Please couple. Please do. And like, I think there's a few. This is blowing my mind. This is crazy. Probably a few. Oh, yeah. So this is first Doc Samson. This is also a different color scheme. It's pretty much the same character. Okay. Like, but it's just a different color scheme for the book. And that's the first Thanos. And that's the, uh, yeah, French-Canadian edition. Of oh, hey, dude. So, oh, like, perfect. Oh. Like, but I just think that the, it's it's awesome because they didn't have, like, these, most of these, some of these came out the exact same time that the American editions came out. Yeah. And some of them, like, you know, in Italy, you know, they'll wait, like, an entire year, and then they'll put 12 issues into one book. Oh, okay, So okay. for Italian editions, a lot of them you get you maybe get like the first Miles Morales and the first spider Gwen in the it's exact one same single book. book. And so that stuff, that stuff was ignored for a long time. Yeah. You know, we, cause I've been doing shows since I was 15. So like, I, but I remember going to a show, like I bought a first Thor journey into mystery 83 when I was in London. Like I purchased it from a bookshop. And like I brought it here and I took it around with me and, and people were like, wow, that's a great. Yeah. Oh, it's from the UK. And yeah. nobody wanted it. But now like the market of course. is, is of course. starting to change and people are actually asking for. Because these are these are way more rare. Of than course. The American yeah. Editions. I was going to say so since I'm from I'm from Quebec, so I'm from, mm -hmm. you know, French Canada. I have comic books that are in French. I yeah. assume it would depend on what they are, but there's actual value in that. Oh yeah, and that, oh, now, now, now market too is that is hmm. that is I can, you know because everybody for any collectible they're always looking for the next big thing, You're right? right? And like two years ago, three it was newsstand copies of things, yep, and those yep. things have started to cool a little bit. So something always takes its place, and and I think that's international. I think it's where the market is going. Yeah. I think it's going to be. So yeah, if you have those, especially if there's a price difference and then a, like a lot of, you know, like if you have No so, way, that's international? Oh, this isn't it. This is not. Oh, this okay, just, okay. But I'm just saying so if there's a new stamp barcode down here with a price with a yeah, uh, the, the, the Canadian price, those are like crazy expensive right now. Okay. I just got some right. GI Joe yeah. books in. So if you have like GI Joe books, those are pretty like popular in that condition. I have like I have Italian Spider Man's here and I can't find I don't know where they went, but oh yeah, right here. So Oh, oh that's so, cool. Yeah, so that's, oh, oh dude. What do those so, go yeah. for? So I mean, because so yeah, they're both because it's new, right? Yeah, so and they're above I, nine. I, I would say they're both nine fours. So this would be the the first Italian edition of Venom, right? And this, yeah. and this is the fall opening of going back to the classic costume. Yeah. So this is probably a nine four. It's probably around like eight hundred, I think. And okay. This is probably closer to six, yeah. I think. Uh -huh. So it's an, it's a nicer grade, but it's you know not a Venom first appearance. Yes. So okay. I think probably in that range, probably like so eight, cool. maybe That's thousand. very cool. But yeah, so if you if you have any of those books, like especially if there's a first appearance in it, I'd like I'd pull it and put it aside. Dude, well, thanks for the history lesson too. Yeah, man, this is so uh, cool. Yeah, it's my pleasure. I do this like literally. I mean, we all do shows with the company, but I just every single show that I'm at, this is pretty much it's like Antiques Roadshow. Yeah, yeah. That's how I describe to my friends. But, but yeah, awesome. It is. Yeah, Thank awesome. you. Yeah, yeah. Hell yeah. yeah.
All right, that is a wrap. I'm gonna turn around here so we can get these amazing guests with full hands. We did not know this was gonna turn into a, a toy hunt vlog. In any guys. way, yeah, no. shopping spree, uh, pr probably one of the greatest items that I own in my collection. Uh, same. Just, uh, this casually yeah, this got is it today for me, Buffalo. yeah. Yeah, literally all walked out with graded action figures uh, and we showed up to do business for All Elite Wrestling and promote their cards and, and break some packs, which you guys saw earlier in the vlog. Can I expense this? To who? AEW. Oh, oh, I don't know. Uh, are we going to send that through the app? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Could you imagine sending a photo of uh, like a graded action figure with the price? That they did give us receipts. Yeah. All right, what did you get? Coming your way, AEW Legal. Uh, so I think I started something pretty bad because we were walking through at the start and Batman animated series figures caught my eye as they did Evil Uno as yes. well. Yes. Everybody that watches the vlog knows I absolutely love Mr. Freeze. I love this toy line. I own one graded figure, ironically also has the same superpowers. I have a Sub-Zero that's graded, and now I have a Mr. Freeze graded Batman Anatomy and Series figure. Probably one of my favorite things I own. Yeah, awesome. Yeah. So we talked about this, this was the most articulated figure at the time. Yeah. It's very normal now, but this, I loved this figure. It was a cruiserweight in my uh, Bone Cruncher uh, division, but also yep one of my favorite action figures. Just the best Spider-Man up until like Marvel Legends, really. So this is awesome. Scorpio Sky. is so... Um, uh, Scorpio Sky said that he used this as like Rey Mysterio. Yeah, yeah really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh. Look, at the, look at the nostalgia on that. I know. Unbelievable. I love it. That's a great... You've talked about that figure on my vlog before, actually. Yes, yeah, so yeah. it's very cool that and you got to... Pod. Yeah. He found it graded, too. Yeah. Uh, I wasn't going to get a single item, I'll be honest with you. Uh, but then Julian uh, purchased himself a Batman Kenner action figure, and I'm also collecting Batman action sure figures. Sure are. And could not stop myself from spending money, so I ended up getting one of the sole ones I don't have. So you left. don't have this figure. I do not have Power Vision Batman, but now I do, and it's graded, and it looks beautiful. It's it does, gonna be, dude. It's going to be my centerpiece, I think, to Absolutely. be honest. Yeah. It's and very the, cool. the gradings on these, so if you're into graded stuff too, this place apparently only deals with highly graded stuff. Mm -hmm. They were they saying that it's very rare they have something that's a six or whatever sixty. Yeah. Uh, most things are seventy five and up. Mine is a seventy five plus. Mine's a seventy five plus as well. Seventy five plus. Mom. Got 80 right here for Smart Mark. We added to the collection in a big way. Uh, I think it's very cool that all three of us got graded, <laughs> freaking graded. Hold yours up so we can thumbnail this one. <laughs> uh, we all also, up with... by the way, we paid. Yes. Oh, yes, oh, yeah. yes, yes. This yes. was not free. This yes. was not free. Yes. Not a gift. And Udo paid 3,000 bucks. Okay, no, whoa, no, whoa, yeah, whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> How am I gonna downplay three thousand dollars? <laughs> That's not true. It's not true. That's not true, Mrs. Uno. Please, I would never do that. <laughs> and I, I would never, never do that to my we're, friends. We're literally about to go on our honeymoon. I would never do that. Oh, this will come out after that. You're fine. Oh yeah, perfect. <laughs> and yes, I did spend. No, okay. <laughs> uh, thank you, Uno, for suggesting myself and Mark to do this. Yes. Oh hey, I knew this was good. I didn't know it was gonna be this cool. Yeah. But I thought definitely. Oh, we're opening packs. I, they said they have toys. I'm like, oh, these are the people put for yeah, sure. Yeah, and it ended up being a massive warehouse uh, that we barely got to show you guys uh, how much of it because we didn't even get yeah, to see it all. Yeah, yeah, we didn't walk through it at all. It no. was crazy. Uh, everyone that works here though was super, super kind, very, very nice. And these weren't even in the inventory. We literally were just picking through stuff that's not even in their store, and they went out of their way to make sure that we could get these, added them to inventory, and sold them to us. It was yeah. very, very cool and kind of them. Uh, so thank you guys very much. And check out their website if you want to purchase anything from their store. But don't forget, you can always buy things from me and Mark on Whatnot. Because they sponsor every single weekly toy hunt. Click the link in the description, download the app, and save 10 bucks on your first auction on me. $10? And MajorWhatnot.com for us. MajorWhatnot.com every Monday at 6.30. Whoa, That's I right. could save $10 twice? Twice. Well, no, I think it's only your first oh, purchase. Oh, just first purchase? Unless you make Maybe another account. Accounts. Well, I'm Have fun. Way. Do that. Okay. <laughs> Like, subscribe, and comment, guys, and follow all these guys on their social medias. Uh, Smart Mark Sterling, like he said, major wrestling figure podcast every single week, as well as they do uh, toy hunts as well on their YouTube channel. Uno, big time Twitcher. You can find me, Evil Uno, or all of the AW Games content is also me. That's twitch.tv slash AW Games. That's right. We're the graded boys, and we bought these That's today. Right. Ego, ego, all about the ego. Well, that's a wrap. At the end of the event, Dave and Adams gifted 
myself, Evil Uno and Smart Marks doing a gift card to their website, allowing us to purchase a bunch of stuff. It was very, very nice of them, especially because I just recently got into graded comics. And like I mentioned earlier in the video at the start, I left with uh, a graded action figure as well. This Mr. Freeze is now home in the loving care of all Eagle Ethan Page, will be in the collection forever. It's my second animated series, Mr. Freeze, but this one graded, protected, and kept in case forever. And we also got the graded comics. These two have not been hung up yet. Amazing covers, amazing additions to the Amazing Spider-Man. Let's see how I said amazing so many times. <laughs> uh, both of these are amazing. I love having the Vulture on a cover and I love having Kingpin on a cover. These are classic Spider-Man, uh, amazing Spider-Man covers and I am obsessed with them. I'm so, 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 so happy. I can't say enough good things about David Adams. I really can't. The staff was amazing. The facility was amazing. Their setup for their live event was incredible. Hollywood level. Thank you guys so much for inviting AEW. I hope we represented AEW to the best of our ability. I hope you guys had fun having myself, Smart Mark Sterling, and Evil Uno there. We sure did. We appreciate the gifts from you guys and you allowing us to purchase things from the warehouse even though they weren't even in the system or on sale. If that was the case, I wouldn't have left with this. So thank you, 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 thank you. Thank you. Okay, now, big announcement. October 30th, plan ahead. Halloween themed live auction with the guy who's afraid of everything Halloween. And you saw last week, the bunny purchased an amazing two pack for whatnot to auction off from Halloween themed Michael Myers. And you also saw the Bible man, which I'm gonna need because I'm afraid of literally everything. So I might need to pray a couple times for how petrified I'm gonna be for this stream on October 30th. But set your calendars, go download the WhatNot app, prepare yourself for one of the best auctions in the game. It's gonna be so much fun. The last one we did was incredible on September 30th. Uh, we're always trying to have as many fun things, as many nostalgic things, and things connected to these videos that you watch every single Sunday. So thank you everyone who's been supporting. We are about at 3,000 followers on WhatNot. So make sure you jump on WhatNot and get $10 off your first purchase on me. Join the auctions, guys. It's really fun. You can just jump in the comments. The last time we uh, gave away a free pair of AirPods. You know what? Let's effing do it again. October 30th, we're going to give away another pair of free AirPods. You want to win a pair of AirPods? Join the stream. That's it. All you got to do is follow the account and just be there. Be there October 30th and you can win a pair, uh, free pair of AirPods. That's it. I'm just trying to have fun with this stuff, guys. I'm loving whatnot. I'm loving these toy hunts. I'm loving sharing my nostalgia and love for this stuff with my friends, my coworkers, and making new friends. Like Wood Hawker. That's right. Huge collaboration coming soon. Can't wait for you guys to see it. Can't wait to start editing it. We got a lot of big stuff on the horizon for the YouTube channel for the Toy Hunt vlog, my comic book. You want updates on that? That's right, patreon.com slash Ethan Page. Uh, you would have been able to watch this video early on there, as well as the Wood Hawker videos coming out soon, where I collaborated with Beat Em Ups on YouTube. So only place you could get any updates on all Ego Ethan Page's comic book. What's up, buddy? You wanna say bye to everybody? Come here. Ugh. All right, don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment. You wanna say bye? Look, say bye. No, you can't open that. Sorry. No, you can't have that either. This is all baddies. Bye. Say bye. Than worthy of your little cover story. When I was a kid, my ego used to cover for me. Wait.
way back when, even now as men We go and hit the town just to watch the bags bend Me and my ego to see the black bends Oh, you have friends? I never needed those All I keep is foes, and my feelings froze Plus a couple evil secrets that my ego knows You a tool, needle nose, see them bleach your soul I am why they pay the fee, I'm the one they came to see Ego, ego, me and my ego Seems stranger to you than sci-fi, my guy. He's